Good evening, shopaholics and shoppers alike. Welcome, welcome back to another video. If you're new here, hi, hello, my name is Lisa and welcome. So in today's video, we are going to be doing a Black Friday haul. Don't all clap at once, don't all clap at once, okay? I know the thought of that tickles your fancy. Here at Shopaholics United, we don't judge each other. We are here with a pretty little thing, Black Friday haul. And I did one of these last year and I'm back again doing another one this year. Cyber Monday sales. I know Pretty Little Thing are gonna have loads of discounts and sales site wide. So this is the perfect time to pick up those pieces that you've had your eye on. Yeah. Before we go on, if you haven't already subscribed to my channel, please don't forget to subscribe. We are so close to 30 Okay, points. so the first thing I picked up is called the Black Shine Puffer Maxi Coat, and I got this in a size 10. I was inspired to pick this up from an outfit that I saw on Instagram wear. Um, her name is Naomi Gents, Naomi Jeans. She wore this really big, like beige kind of puffy coat and then a hoodie inside with a really cute fluffy hat with trainers. And I kind of wanted to kind of copy that look just for like everyday wear. It's basically this long, shiny puffer coat and it is also a maxi coat. So it is very, very long. It has this tie waist detail at the front of the jacket. What I really like about this is that it kind of has that duvet kind of jacket style. I can't wait to wear this with a grey pretty little thing hoodie I have and then some joggers or some jeans and then air forces and a fluffy woolly hat and I'm literally just good to go. I got this in a size 10 and it fits me perfectly. This next item is called the black collar faux fur jacket. Already started to wear this jacket because it's absolutely gorgeous. It's just basically a faux fur jacket. It's kind of cropped basically and it's kind of got this kind of bubble effect. I don't know whether you guys can see it and I just thought it was just really really gorgeous to wear with a hoodie and some jeans or to wear anywhere really. Or it would just make a really really gorgeous winter staple. I got this in a size 10. So the next item we have is a tiny bit out of my comfort zone. It is called the Khaki Vinyl Crinkle Trench Coat in a size 12. I've had my eye on vinyl trench coats for quite some time now. I think it was Melissa's wardrobe with a gorgeous kind of, I think it was blue vinyl trench coat and I was like, oh my gosh, that looks absolutely stunning. I wish I could pull that off. But I was tired of seeing everybody and their mum wearing a gorgeous, gorgeous trench vinyl coat. So I was like, you know what? I'm gonna get this one from Pretty Little Thing and I'm gonna experiment. It's this gorgeous, gorgeous khaki vinyl trench coat. Can we just admire that khaki please? Because just how stunning is this color khaki? And it's actually quite long. I don't know whether you guys can see that. Then it's got the belt detail as well, like somewhat shiny but matte at the same time. It's a very like kind of muted down version of a vinyl trench coat. I could wear something like this with some black grey jeans and then like a turtleneck and some boots. I'm super, super in love with this trench coat. The next item we have is called the Multi Renaissance Porcelain Pin Detail corset blazer dress and I got this in a size 10. It's basically a blazer style dress and then it's got the corset detail in the middle. I don't know whether this really necessarily screams Lisa. When I went to the Pretty Little Thing Little Mix launch party, I saw a girl there and she was, I believe she was wearing this dress. When I saw the dress, I was like, my next haul, I definitely have to pick this up. I got this in a size 10 because the corset blazer that I had in my last haul got in a size 8 and it was tight so I went ahead and got a size 10 with this you have to remember I have a lack of bosom I have a white pair of heels to pair with this Mwah. chef's kiss it's my friend Lexus's birthday coming up this week 
no, not coming up this week. It was actually yesterday. So happy birthday, Alexis. She wants to do an afternoon tea for her birthday. So I thought this would just be the perfect dress. The next thing I picked up is another dress. There's actually quite a few dresses in this haul. Everything is pretty much going out pieces. Next thing I picked up is called the Tan Velvet Snake Print Strappy Cow Neck Maxi Dress in a size eight. I've just kind of been really, really obsessed with maxi dresses as of recently. I've been really really kind of Kim K inspired like the whole maxi dress and heels kind of vibe that she goes for I've kind of been kind of swaying to that kind of style of like going out outfits just because I feel like they suit my body shape more it's basically this gorgeous velvet maxi dress in this absolute gorgeous snake print no guys we rinsed out snake print during summer I mean if something looks good then something looks good and i just quite haven't let go of the snake print trend yet so fight me fight me fight me then it's got a cow neck and then it is actually actually real life a maxi dress i am a short ingo though but i'm not that short and it's generally maxi on me i've already tried this on Mwah, chef's kiss With some really long crimped wavy hair some heels that i got on this haul we have yet another maxi dress pretty little thing do them really 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 well the shape nude oriental print sleeveless midi dress i actually bought this dress like a month ago in the black and the gray version and i just fell in love i'm just gonna go ahead and pick up the nude it's in this gorgeous oriental print and then it comes up ruched in the middle all the way down to the end of the dress the black one looked really good on me so the nude one will look good on me as well and this with a pair of like gold strappy heels and then a really gorgeous bag so moving on to yet another dress the shape black knit one shoulder madaxi dress and i got this in a size eight basically a one shouldered rib maxi dress i saw this on the model and she looked absolutely stunning in it thought this would just be a really 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 like good going out basic i've tried this on i would have been much much better off with a size 10 because it's even tight on the body being a jersey bodycon dress i thought it would just be really stretchy but it's not as stretchy and this is from the shape range as well so i don't know moving on to an outfit that i thought would look really really good together the first thing i have is the black oriental printed short sleeve t-shirt and i got this in a size small again it's just the oriental print that i showed you guys in that dress but this is the gray and black version just in a gorgeous crop t-shirt i thought it would look absolutely stunning paired with these lace up trousers and these are called the khaki lace woven eyelet lace up detail straight leg trousers and i got these in a size 14. this is what the trousers look like they've got this gorgeous lace up detail on the side of the trouser and they're in this cotton material they're defo not stretchy not in the slightest they're in this gorgeous like kind of bright khaki color come all the way down into a straight leg so i promise you they're not skinny they're not carved literally a good straight leg which i like oh, what do you guys think yay nay are we feeling it are we not i thought the two of these together will just make a really gorgeous like going out outfit if you're going to dinner if you're going to drink i just really 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 fell in love with these trousers i basically tried to get them in the black september times but they were completely sold out so when they brought the car key i was like yeah that's it i have to have no questions asked. the next thing i picked up is actually from the little mitts collection these are really really nice you guys know the split hem straight leg trend has been in and is still in these are called the black vinyl skinny trousers and i got these in a size 12. i'd actually seen them on the site but then i hadn't really noticed them you know when you're just scrolling you don't really take everything in jamila showed them to me and i was like wait a minute i saw those they're actually really really nice she bought them and i was like 
I absolutely have to have that and right now they look so good on her they keep on going in and out of stock at the drop of a hat so ladies if you want these do not mess about these are vinyl trousers slash leggings they've got this gorgeous split hem detail so it's like a zip so you can zip it down where it's skinny but who the hell wants to do that and you can zip it up if it wants to do that and then wear it like this i absolutely love to wear things like this love going for like a sexy trouser and top combo i got these in a size 12. next thing i have again is from the pretty little thing little mitts collection it's this like gorgeous denim crop top it's in this really really hard stiff denim and it's like an indigo denim this was like part of a whole outfit it had the matching denim skinny jeans the matching denim boots the matching denim choker and the matching denim bag one of the models who models from pretty little thing jess hunt on instagram she was wearing this complete outfit with all the matching clothes and accessories and she just looks so stunning you guys know my love of denim i thought this would go really really nice with a pair of indigo denim flare jeans and then some heels basically it's got this like tie up corset kind of detail at the back i do wish though it was a tad bit longer okay. so the next thing we have is called the gray velvet tie-dye cycle shorts and i got this in a size 10 tie-dye pair of a velvet shorts in this black and brown kind of tie-dye and dying to wear like a blazer and cycle short combo i was gonna pair this with almost light khaki blazer a corset blazer that i'd seen on pretty lots of things but the khaki blazer was actually out of stock i only managed to get the shorts so i'm thinking like what the hell am i gonna pair these shorts with but then alas i thought i could either pair this with a leather blazer and some gorgeous heels with nothing underneath or with a leather shirt when i try it on you guys will see if the vision comes to life or not so the next thing we have are called the vintage wash side split hem distressed jeans and i got these in a size 12 you guys know i will just never get enough of jeans i will never get enough of denim i don't believe there's ever a time where i'll ever have too many jeans a straight leg jean kind of girl I don't know what skinny jeans are just look like this and then they've got these ripped holes on the knee and then they go all the way down into an actual straight leg and then frayed at the bottom i absolutely just love these even with the khaki blazer that i was talking about and a pair of heels you can literally just wear these with anything these are more of a going out jean i wouldn't necessarily wear these casual like with trainers okay, so the last of the clothing items we have and you're probably thinking lisa what the hell so basically i was scrolling the new in as per usual that's all i pretty much do and i saw this dress and for some reason it just reminded me of kim k basically kim kardashian had worn the exact same thing and it was basically an inspired version of the dress so this is called the shape silver metallic slinky scoop neck medaxi dress and i got this in a size eight basically this bodycon medaxi dress and it's in this like gorgeous shiny gun metallic color it looked absolutely stunning on the model and they actually had a bronze version the bronze was out of stock so I had to go for the silver instead however i love the bronze version so much that i waited for the eight to come back in stock and i snatched it up i'm gearing towards the bronze more it's the bronze the bronze wins it guys just look the metallic is nice but it's a bit much and the bronze is gorgeous so i'm gonna try both on for you and you guys are gonna vote down below which one do you prefer gun metallic silver or the bronze i'm gearing towards the bronze just because the tones my skin Mwah. we finally come to the last item of the haul so i went ahead and picked up another pair of heels this was a pair of heels that i've actually had in my wish list for like over a month now these are called the black clear wedge strappy sandal 
and I got these in a size 5. They're basically this Perspex wedge sandal heel and they look like this. So when I saw these, I just said yes, absolutely just a bit of me. Some people are not a fan of wedge, but you guys are thinking of the Towie, the Only Ways Essex, out on Marbella Beach, Ibiza kind of wedge. This is not that kind of wedge. It's got the black sole. How pretty are those? Paired with all the dresses and outfits that I got in this video, they just go so well. And I really, really hope you guys enjoyed this haul. I really, really hope you guys found some really gorgeous bits that you can put in your wish list, in your favourites, or ready for Black Friday. All the links for all the items will be down below. Do not forget to check out the Pretty Little Thing website on Black Friday because, like I said, Pretty Little Thing are going to have loads of discounts and sales all over the site thank you to pretty little thing for sponsoring this video i really really hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did please do not forget to give it a big thumbs up if you haven't already subscribed to my channel please don't forget to subscribe i will see you guys in my next one Mwah. bye